And this goes for anybody. You know what I'm saying? If you guys, if yeah, if you keep paying certain things, there's only a certain like I'm not gonna be able to keep people off you guys, <laughs> but for so long. And when I say people, I mean my family. And you're talking about two, like you're talking about it. Like my brother was a gangster. <laughs> for me, my, my brother don't really even play like that. Never play with niggas like that. And there's a lot of family that I'm not gonna get into that. Okay. Just know. I, Wait, what was you about to say? I couldn't be able to keep people off yard for too long. Listen. Vice versa. But you see how you get hurt and upset when somebody talk about your family. You see how it hurts you and how it stings? How do you think I feel? You don't get a pass. You do not. Dead or not. Stop talking about my family. Guns and butter, baby. You act like they stopped making gangsters when they made yours. You act like they stopped making family when they made yours. Yeah. I know it looked like we out here dangling, we out here lacking. Come find out though. All this, I can't keep, I cannot put my family off this long. Then stop talking about my family and I won't bring up yours. She did pay for your brother's funeral. Look y'all, shit just really hit the fan between Clarence and Tina and Queen Naja and all this drama that's going on, man. Now it's starting to get real, real serious, okay? Now it was all fun and games for our entertainment, seeing them go back and forth and react and be petty. But now it looks like there's potential threats being thrown out there, physical harm being thrown out there, and this is not looking good, okay? Now as you guys heard the audio, and of course I'm going to let you guys hear the audio again, Clarence decided to possibly make a... a you know, a potential threat um, towards Tina and basically threatening bodily harm towards her. Um, basically, you know, alluding that people that he know that's in his camp will be willing to do something to Tina allegedly or possibly her brother in order for them to be shut up. You feel me? Yo, this stuff is getting real, real crazy. And of course, you know, that's not all the tea that I have, man. It looks as if Tina's father has stepped in and basically put out a fair warning to Clarence, okay, about him threatening his two kids, man. So this is getting real, real crazy. I'm about to read this to you, okay. This is from, um, allegedly from Tina and Rel's father, okay. That's the father of Queen Naja's siblings, okay. Now, this is allegedly by him. I'm going to read it. But first, before I do, make sure you guys hit that subscribe button, like button, and notification bell. This is a DJ Jericho podcast where we talk about celebrity news and commentary and gossip. Um, if you guys want to join the community, make sure you guys hit that subscribe button. Now, let's get to it. All right, it says Clarence. This Tina and Rel's father. I'm going to keep this short. I'm not one for a lot of talk, so I'm going to get straight to the point. I watched Tina video, and she mentioned your people's yes. But let's be clear. It's just words. You come across like that's a threat. Nobody. I mean, nobody's going to touch or harm Tina or Rel. I will ba break inside of hell over mines. You want to talk about gangster? Let them be harmed in any way. You or whoever... I uh, will find out. This is my warning to you. So, y'all, this is definitely starting to get a really, really dark. You know, it's starting to give me a real dark, demonic energy. Um, yo, and honestly, for y'all that don't know why Clarence took that route, it's because uh, Tina made a statement um, in regards to Clarence paying for his own deceased brother's funeral, uh, basically saying that Queen Naja paid for all the expenses. And that, myself, me personally, I felt that was a low blow. You know what I'm saying? And Clarence basically came back with that statement, make, making warnings and stuff like that to people. Honestly, this is just embarrassing for everybody. I need them to slow their roll. I need them to get off of YouTube. I need them to clean up this entire mess because at this point, it's starting to get very uh, scary. And I really don't want to hear any bad news about anybody getting shot, nobody being killed or anything else. Okay. Now, it's, it's very uh, unfortunate 
that there is two children involved in the middle of all this mess, okay, and mayhem amongst all of these adults who seem to can't get it together. You know what I'm saying? I'm not sure what's going on with Queen Naja, but you know, she got a lot of decisions to make in regards to whether she should just become single or you know fix everything that's going on with her boyfriend she got a lot of things to, to consider especially with her having two kids involved this is absolutely getting ridiculous you feel me um but anyways like i said before you guys i'm going to keep you guys posted and updated you know um, i want to know what you guys think okay do you guys think that it was okay for clarence to make these threats towards tina and her brother um do you guys think he went over the line with that um, do you guys think that um, this this statement allegedly by their father, you know, did he do the right thing with doing that? And also, do you agree with Tina's response? You know what I'm saying? You hear her basically saying that she got shot and stuff like this. Y'all, this is just getting too deep. It's getting crazy. You know what I'm saying? But like I said before, um, I want to know what you guys think about this whole situation. Of course, we're going to talk about it further. I was going to do the reaction video tonight, but honestly, it's just like two hours of a long, drawn out situation. And I'm going to do that when I and when it permits uh, when it permits for me. Um, when it comes to my schedule and my time, I did watch both videos, so I know exactly what's going on. It's just doing a reaction with y'all. It's just I, I have to really be focused in doing that, and I didn't have the time today. But anyway, y'all tell me what y'all think about the situation. Do you guys feel like? Um, at this point, Clarence, Tina, and uh, everybody else involved should just get off the internets and shut this whole thing down and go see a Yanla like Queen Naja ass. You know what I'm saying? Do you guys think that this whole thing will stop before anybody else or possibly anybody get physically harmed? Um, y'all tell me what y'all think about the whole situation, y'all, but I had to come out with this video, um, you know, and I'll catch y'all on the next one. Make sure you guys subscribe. Much love. It's DJ J. Erica. Peace.